Hey guys, welcome back. So, in this part of our free pick series we will discuss about logo design, we will try to cover whole process including finding inspiration, designing logo, preparing vector file and uploading it on Freepik so stay connected. I usually start with surfing different micro stock websites like Graphic River or Invato, Freepik, Logopond.com, Instagram, Behance, etc. for inspiration and to check out current trends. Right now, while recording this video I noticed lot of logos on environment so I decided to design a logo with combination of letter and leaf. But remember your design shall be unique and not a copy design. I downloaded some reference photos and started sketching some ideas. Now now after finalizing one sketch I made a rough tracing, I wanted the logo to be some sort of line art. As midrib of leaf need to be pointy, so I used width tool to make it pointy and adjusted the thickness of other parts to balance the flow. You can make multiple variations and choose the best one. For good quality avoid extra anchor points and make it clean. As the logo was made for environment so we will use green color and use some free fonts. You can download variety of free fonts from fonts.google, avoid using any premium fonts. We can also change some variations and choose the one that matches with theme and also avoid using multi fonts. Two different fonts are enough for one logo. So after finalizing our design, it's time to prepare files. Set your files dimension as 2000 by 2000 pixels, as Freepik require RGB for their templates so you will select RGB as color mode. Set resolutions at 72 and click create. Now copy paste your design. You can add a pastel colored background to make it more appealing. Now click F7 to open layer properties or click on layer icon at right. Create two layers and rename them as graphics and background. Put background layer at bottom and rename the square as background and transfer it to background layer. Put logo and text in graphic layer, put path layer of logo on above and rename it into logo icon and text layer into logo text. Now save your file as EPS, you can save it into any version like CC, EPS 10 or 8 for this logo I am using EPS CC version. Now export the file as JPEG and ensure use artboard is checked. Now go to the file location and ensure the name of both JPEG and EPS file are same. You will need to prepare 10 files, of any category, by following same procedure, now go to contributor.freepik, log in your account and click on upload files. Select both EPS and JPEG files and drag and drop them. Once uploading is completed the Freepik will navigate you to final point, Write down the title for your design add 5 to 50 tags. 
the tags are important for SEO so use relevant words. Follow the same procedure for other 9 files and then click on send to revision at top right. Hope this video will be helpful for you in next part of series we will try to cover the topic of business card templates.